law plays a proper function in curtailing sin. So we have a responsibility to seek to use laws to restrain the outward sinful conduct of people, even where we can't use them, we never can use them, to change people's hearts. If I truly love my neighbor, I want laws that will protect my neighbor's marriage, that will give good education to my neighbor, that will protect my neighbor's health and well-being and economic well-being so the government doesn't steal everything from us. And I think it is a way of obeying Jesus' command, you shall love your neighbor as yourself. If pastors don't get involved in confronting the moral issues of our day biblically, we'll soon digress to become a lawless nation and frankly, we're on the very edge of that right as we speak. Our country is becoming an immoral country because so many preachers have withdrawn from the culture completely. There is no part of life that is neutral to which Christ doesn't say, it's mine. No part of life. And there is no neutrality on any moral issue whatsoever. And all of life is religious. The Bible does tell us that God will hold us accountable for how we act. I think that includes all of life and certainly it includes how we have acted in responsibility toward influencing government.